Let's watch the workflow process. We're looking at an Excel order form for spa covers. It includes one day's orders in various styles, sizes, and fabrics. On this line, we see that order number 112 is for a spa cover style named Octagon. It calls for top material to be VY007 and bottom material to be VY100. When we look in the Patternsmith material library, we see that VY007 is brown vinyl and VY100 is liner vinyl. Order number 108 is for a rectangle with radius corners style. It will be made using top material VY003, beige vinyl, and bottom material VY100, liner vinyl. Workflow can use either master patterns or master templates. This particular example uses patterns generated by our parametric pattern making software called templates. All the dimensions required to create correctly sized patterns are included on each line in the order. Our order form for the day's production includes all the information needed to make 42 different spa covers. We're ready to open Workflow. From the Order tab, we click Open and navigate to Today's Order Form. When we open this order in Workflow, each line holds the same information as the corresponding order line in the Excel file. It's just in a different format. For example, the information for the Octagon style, order number 112, made from materials VY007 and VY100 is here. The information for the rectangle with radius corners, order number 108, made from materials VY003 and VY100 is here. When we click Process the Order, Workflow uses the templates engine in the background to generate all the patterns required for each style and size. As each pattern is created, it gets linked to the fabric specified in the order form. In the top of this screen, we see all the patterns that will be cut from beige vinyl material VY003. When we mouse over the line for order number 108, a rectangle with radius corner style, we now see all the patterns to be cut for that cover. Moving down to brown vinyl, material VY007, we can find the patterns we need to cut for order 112, an octagon cover. We can select all the patterns to be cut from beige vinyl and drag them into a destination cutter. Workflow just combined them into a single Patternsmith file for beige vinyl. Now, we'll select all the patterns to be cut from brown vinyl and let Workflow combine them into a single file at the same cutter destination. The files we just created are ready to open and nest in Patternsmith. We'll open the brown vinyl file as an example. Patterns from each line in the order form are now grouped together in placement groups. We'll select all the patterns in all the groups and tell Patternsmith to start auto-nesting. Nesting would actually take 60 seconds, but we'll speed that up here. As we scroll through each of the nested tables, notice that each pattern shows its order number. Patternsmith uses that information to show the cutting table operator how to place patterns into the right kits.